Good day, welcome to Getting It Done North of Seven. Today we're working on this fairly new lawnmower. It's just a cheap lawnmower I bought at our Canadian Tire. And these wheels, the way it is made is so cheap. What it is, is it has a bolt that goes right through the center of the wheel and screws into threads right here with no nut behind. So what happened was the threads on the bolt had started to, I guess it started to come loose, the bolt came loose and it moved around and it stripped the threads on the bolt. So I'm gonna show you a simple fix for that because you know a lot of people wouldn't know what to do and then you wouldn't be able to use your new lawnmower. This lawnmower is in perfectly running shape. It's nice and light, it's easy to use. So I wanna be able to use it. I'm gonna show you just a simple fix to get it up and going again so you can cut your lawn. So there you go, the threads, you can see they're wore out and the threads inside here are wore out. And so this is all it holds the wheel on. It just screws in here like that, and that's it. That's all it holds the wheel on. So you imagine with all the vibration and movement, they do become loose. This is what it looks like on the other side. It's just the threads, no nut. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna drill a hole through the bolt, and then I'm gonna use, like you could use a cotter pin, you can use one of these, just put this through here, that'll stop the bolt from coming out and your wheel falling off. Or you can go old school <laughs> and you could like you could cut some of this off and then put it through the bolt and then all you gotta do is just bend it. And that would stop it from the bolt bolt from coming out of that hole as well. Now I've already started the hole I'm drilling here through this bolt. You're gonna need a drill bit for steel and a small one. I probably could have used a smaller one to start the hole but I didn't have one but this is working so I just got to finish going through here through the bolt so there we got through and hopefully this will fit this will fit just like that perfect now we'll install the wheel back on the lawnmower. Okay, we just run the bolt through the wheel like this. Put it into the hole. Probably thread it in the old threads. That'll help keep it held in there. There we go. And now we'll put the pin in there. There you go, you can see our pin inside holding the bolt. Everything's working good. We're good to go. We're good to cut lawn. So there we go. It's a simple fix for your lawnmower. Get that wheel back on, get you out cutting lawn. So these are the problems you run into when you buy cheap lawnmowers. You know, it runs good. It's nice and light. Like I said, we used to do some lawn maintenance and it was great to use for just small patches of lawn. I kind of thought something might go wrong with it eventually, but I didn't think it'd be this quick and I didn't think it'd be one of the wheels like that. So. There's a quick simple fix for you. I did see another video on YouTube like this, so it's the first. If you like tutorials like this, come back, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, and go through our playlist. I'll put a link down in the description below this video, and I'll put an end card at the end of this video where you can go watch a whole playlist on lawnmower fixes, riding lawnmowers, and that sort of thing. I wanna thank you for watching, and have a great day.